So AIT is a great program so far. It uh, has done a really good job of balancing the academic part of the program, so really rigorous courses taught by really good faculty with excellent students to participate in these courses with. But then it also really balances the cultural side with that. I like the school. Um, I think it's, I think it's, uh, I tell people it seems like they've uh, they really have a lot, you know, a lot of planning, uh, a lot of um, a lot of work has been going into this school. I think the city's amazing. I mean, it's not nothing like in the states. I think the people are really nice. They're really friendly, and I, I was surprised that there were a lot of English-speaking Hungarians. So that was very comforting because, like. I could communicate to them. I don't know of any American city that has views like this. This is this is breathtaking, <laughs> to be quite honest. So um, yeah, I just you can't you can't find this in the U.S. and it's just beautiful. There is a cultural and scientific heritage in Budapest and in Hungary in general that anybody who comes here for a short or longer time would truly benefit from. Well, AIT is um, a very special, distinctive, and distinguishing program because it's focused on building cultural connections, and I'm very pleased about that. But it's important because it's focusing on sciences and engineering and mathematics because those fields uh, are moving in an interdisciplinary direction and very key in nanotechnology and biotechnology and all of the combinations and it's the computer scientists, the physicists, the engineers who are going to be part of that and, and Gabor has, has uh, very nicely put together a great set of courses and a great set of instructors who are focusing on that. This school is for those who decided to be a software engineer privately, who have majors in computer science and software engineering. The goal of the course, which is about entrepreneurship, is to help the students to realize whether they want or not to become entrepreneurs. So the outcome is more knowledge about themselves, whether they are appropriate to be an entrepreneur or they should be a very good scientist or a very good software engineer. But we should know the most successful entrepreneurs of the world, like Bill Gates or Steve Jobs. They never had any business school graduation. They had engineering education. So the engineers are the one who could discover themselves the entrepreneurial spirit and became the most successful entrepreneurs of the world. I really like that AIT has strong connections to industry. Like um, my computer vision professor um, is straight from you know the the film industry, and I love that. I love having pe being a being able to speak to people and learn from people who are in the field. In basic sciences and then math, they certainly will get uh, the best training or the best uh, teachers uh, available in the world. The Hungarians see things not in color, not in shapes, not in forms, but in numbers. This image is something that sounds like we are building now in a more uh, foundational way. Opening a university is a great thing and Microsoft is really, really proud to support this idea. For American students it's crucial to, uh, to go abroad, whether that's Europe or whether that's Australia or Africa. Uh, you know, it, the, what matters really is the ability to get out and see different cultures. I think Budapest gives a particular particularly interesting and exciting perspective being at the crossroads of East and West where you get the Western style, style education, you get the Western style uh, lifestyle and yet you are actually exposed to, to, the, to the Eastern style culture and you get the benefits of all. So in that respect I think, uh, I think for American students it is crucial to be exposed to the possibilities offered by the Central European location. In the 21st century it is unavoidable for the students to go to abroad and understand the rest of the world. As a result of the globalization, living in one country is not an option anymore, even for engineers. Even for engineers, it's important to understand why design are different in different countries, why not the same products can be sold everywhere. There are a couple of big exceptions where the same products can be sold everywhere, like, like a McDonald's chain or Coca-Cola or an operating system from Microsoft, but this is minority. Most of the products are local. And if a small or medium-sized company want to produce something to the global market, have to understand the differences of the different markets. 
And if you go to Germany or Japan or to another large country, you can understand the local culture. But if you go to a small country like Hungary, you can understand how these people were able to adopt to the cultural diversity of the world. This is why I believe that in order to understand the diversity of the world, the best thing to go to a small country, because entrepreneurs or engineers or business people from small countries have to understand the world in order to survive. Certainly this, this school is for the students who, who require a, a much above average. So, so it is not the student who would like just to pass the grades and, 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 and to have fun in a foreign country. Well, they will have fun in this country, so that's, that's something. But besides that, this is giving them a special challenge to, to, to solve various interesting problems, which are complex problems, so this can be used in a very unexpected way in their home and I think in, in various later stages of their career they will simply remember that wow a similar problem I have met in Hungary and, and, and we had this solution for that problem and this might be used in, in my situation. So I think this student who is, who is open for these novel situations and novel solutions will have a home here in Hungary in this institute. This institute is special at many levels. It's special in its vision. It's special in its location. It's a beautiful location. And it's special in the way it integrates education and access to the industry. And it is special in the in the kind of in the structure and the educational space where it is placed of what it's trying to achieve rather than giving a full curriculum, you know, focusing on the on the issues that it can do best. So what I expect from this uh, course is to generate a new culture, a new absolutely international, interdisciplinary, uh, very, very freshly reacting culture. The courses are really interesting. I really like the professors. They make the program what it is because they are really approachable and the classes are really very interesting. So I would recommend it to any computer science or mathematics majors or engineering majors who want to experience a life in a beautiful city, Budapest. Yeah, I love the Hungarian students. Um, they teach us a lot about Hungarian culture um, and they're giving us a new perspective in their culture, so it's like awesome. And I, if the Hungarians weren't here, it wouldn't be s such a rich program. I personally think the, the interaction is invaluable for us. Being in a different culture and uh, having people around who are comfortable within the environment, who know the language and who know their way around. And we have so much common ground, we also have so much we can learn from each other. I think this is a very different perspective that a lot of other English speaking programs won't provide. Even in this first month, I see how much potential AIT has as a program. There is no better reason to fly across the ocean than getting knowledge and getting a good course or a good education. I, I think it's, uh, it's good for everybody who, has, uh, who was able to keep uh, the curiosity of uh, childhood. And if you are curious and you would like to discover things, please come.